Do you sometimes feel rubbish at recycling? Well, you're not the only one. But never fear, because we've joined forces with a recycling team in Darlington to find out why recycling is so important and how to do it properly. So what is this here that I'm looking at, Del? Right, now we've got the compartments for the different parts of the recycling. So it doesn't all just get thrown no, into no. one? There's, there's, three, there's three compartments on the recycling wagon. One's for glass, one's for cardboard and paper, and the other one's for plastics and tins. So why can't you put it all together in the same one? Just gets contaminated and it's easier for the sorting. When we take it to the recycling tip, it's easier for them to sort it out. So it looks a little bit scary in there. So is that where it all gets crushed down and condensed? Yeah, once it's once it's full, we press a button and it'll will it'll condense itself in. So we can do a full, hopefully a full day's work on, on one trip. So what do all these different buttons mean? Right, that, these are all your buttons to lift your recycling parts up on each side. So this, this side's your, your plastics and your tins. So we've, we've got the green light on, which means when you stand close to that, it'll automatically lift up. So it'll lift your bin automatically, but you can turn it off and then you can manually, manually do them as well. So it looks like separating your recyclables really is worthwhile. Not only does this help out the people hard at work further down the line, but it also reduces the risk of contamination, which means what you're chucking away will actually end up where it needs to go, helping to reduce our negative impact on the environment. So what is this bit here, Dal? This is where your glass goes for recycling. Ah. So we'll fill this drum up and then it gets tipped into the top of the wagon. Does all the glass get broken in the wagon? A lot of it does. And then it's generally, it, there's a lot of full bottles and that when we go to the unit, the recycling centre, it just depends how, well, it's quite a height. From the top of it, it's quite a height where it drops. So you do get lots of broken glass. So does that get lifted all the way up there and tipped, and then tipped in. in there? Yeah, it wow. does. Is that because there needs to be plenty of room for all the glass that you're picking up? All day, yeah. Yeah. Oh wow. What do these do here, Dal? These are your crushers. Oh. So these... hey, that sounds dramatic, doesn't it? <laughs> this is where you press. Well, you, if you press the button, I can show you anyway. So if you press the button, it'll drag whatever you've put into the tubs. It'll drag it back and condense it. That's what these two buttons are for. Well, this is just the start of the journey. I'm now about to find out what happens after you wave goodbye to your waste.